Thank you, Jay. And while we continue to see high temperatures, we're also seeing dry conditions with portions of the Twin Tiers now officially in a drought. Our 18 Storm Team meteorologist Anna Myers is live in downtown Elmira with more. Good evening, Anna. Thank you, Ria. Now, as of this morning, according to the United States Drought Monitor, portions of the Twin Tiers are now under a drought. Now, this is a moderate drought, or this is level D1. This is the lowest level of all of them and is the least intense. Now, some areas are still just abnormally dry, but in the historical recorded impacts have shown that this could possibly lead to crop growth being stunted in the area. Right now, it's a little early uh, in things drying out to tell if it's going to continue on this way. Uh, we had a really good start this spring and getting things planted fairly early. Everything was way above, you know, the, the same knee high before July. The corn was uh, about a foot higher than that. So it's in good shape right now. If things continue, then um, the concern would rise. This, val this update is valid as of Tuesday, July 18th, as of 8 a.m. and does not account for any rainfall that we have seen since then. But I'll be back at 6 talking more about the different levels of drought, what they mean for us here. But for now, live in Elmira, I'm Anna Myers, 18 News.